You've heard of Madrid, you've heard of Barcelona, but have you heard of Barcelona? Wait, who wrote this? That's not a real place, and also not where we were going. We had escaped from Italy in a rush, and our best flight option was to Zaragoza, a city in Spain. Now all that remained was to see if this was what we wanted. Welcome to Spain. It looks a bit rainy. It does look a bit rainy. Oh, finally, huh? Finally. Well, that was... I would say more relaxed than taking a thousand trains to France. I would say so. I would have liked a bit more sleep, but... Oh, yeah. Aye, aye. If you didn't watch the last episode, we had spent the night at an airport, and I had not slept at all. We were also interrailing, but it was cheaper to fly from Spain to Italy than it was to take the train from France to Spain. Free trains, my ass. Anyway, a not too short bus ride later, we had now arrived in a rainy Zaragoza. You have your umbrella close by? I do. Oh, it doesn't help both of us. No. It looks like it's gonna keep raining. Cool. Well, well, welcome to one of the driest cities in Spain. We're lucky people. I don't know if it is though. I just made that up. <laughs> oh well, no time to waste. We had to get to our hotel, no matter the weather. So we kept walking through this beautiful city. Our train it feels really nice actually. It feels so relaxing. It's really clean as well. We then arrived at our place, and after a long night of no sleep, we took a nap for a few hours. And when we headed out again, the rain had finally stopped. Great success! We then walked around this cozy city for a while, on small narrow streets and wider pretty streets. I think we're gonna burn the this time. Nah. It is really, really strong. It is really strong. Look at this shirt, it's pretty. We admired some old Moorish architecture, and then we made our way to the river. Let's go see 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 the river. I had a slept for three hours. Which I haven't had. Ah, uh, me too. But here is the river. We're at the river. I think you can swim down there. That is a nice view. Oh. Well, it does. Oh, I don't see anything in the shadow. Yeah, that's kind of a problem with the sun. You could have told me. Oh, it still looks cool. I'm gonna to taste the water. You're gonna taste the water? Yeah. What do you mean? No, you cannot drink out of that. Water looks clean. I'm still gonna fall. No. It's nice and cool. Cool. Go for a little swim. I don't have my swimming clothes with me. Nope. Oh man. You can put your feet in there. That might already be nice over there. Maybe I'll do that. Yeah, you do that. Oh, there are a lot of small fishies in there. They're gonna eat you, I think. Are you pretending to swim? So you're sitting in the sun? Close to the water without any sunscreen? We're gonna come back later in the evening, probably tomorrow morning, with the results. I don't think we're gonna be too good. Oh no, I think he heard me saying that, so I guess he decided to get out. Well, they just attacked out. me! <gasps> what? Did they bite? No. Did they try to nibble? I think so. <laughs> My feet are wet. Yeah, I'm dirty. Well, they have to dry. Yeah. You want to try the vegan chicken here? Yeah. Looks nice in that part of the city as well. Yeah. These are... Oh, so burn. oh yeah, I will. These are nice. Nice old rooms. Nice old walls. This is the old Caesar. And everyone knows that the Caesar was Caesar of the Greek Empire. Back in the 1200s. It was also known as the Holy Roman Empire. Oh, you're so annoying. So ended our first day of sightseeing in Zaragoza, only to start again the next morning. Iglesia doesn't mean palace, it means church. I know. Alright, you said palace. 
this day we headed to Palacio de Alcafeira, an old Moorish castle, and also where the Aragonian parliament is located. Although the Moorish architecture was more appealing to us, to be honest. And you can say whatever you want about the Moors, not to be confused with the 1960s rock band The Doors, whose most famous song, Riders of the Storm, I cannot play because of copyright reasons, but they were pretty gosh darn good at architecture and patterns. The Moors, not the Doors, just to be clear. Or, I don't know about the Doors, maybe they were, but they did not design this. I'm learning a lot here. Yeah, it was a cool little palace and museum. Not too expensive, and we were happy with our visit. I vote thumbs up, cold plate. What do we do now for the rest of the day? Well, I'll tell you what we did. We found cool stuff by the water. We did laundry. Ha! We almost ate at McDonald's. Well, but no veggie stuff. And yeah, that was pretty much it. Cool shirts we've seen so far, I would say. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Not only that, it was free. It's crazy how cool this it is. Yeah, Saragossa is a really nice city, and I'm happy we ended up there. I would recommend a visit if you find a cheap flight there or just want to experience a not so touristy Spanish city. But now it's time for us to move on. Bakery search in the morning in Spain is not really a good thing to do. Turns out, no. There are no bakeries open in the morning. No, there were not, but at least we found a cafe where we could have a bite before we headed to the train station. How do we know which gate we would have to enter at? Uh, that is a good question. If we haven't... I don't get this train station already, I feel like. Well, let's just enter a gate and see where we end up. Vestibulo de Gatos. Okay. Let's go there, whatever vestibulo. Arrival? <laughs> no, a vestibule. Oh my god, we are so stupid. What? We are so stupid. I was like thinking the whole time, you got us, it's not the place where we start from. That is Salidas. Oh Jesus Christ. Oh my god, we are so stupid. We are so, so stupid. We are so fucking stupid. Yes, we were. Earlier that year, we spent two and a half months in Mexico. We both speak basic Spanish, but somehow we forgot that llegadas means arrivals and not departures. I well. was thinking the whole time, I was like, llegadas, only at like, airports that is normally like where you like land. Oh my god, we were so stupid. That also makes sense why there's no one here, but everyone got off at the other one. Salidas, out of Saragossa. I thought Salidas meant that people were getting out there. Salidas, huh? Oh my god, we are so stupid. Oh, now we have to cross this really long, huge train. Now look at how big this is. It's <laughs> long. I'm so embarrassed. Oh, wow. Well. One eternity later. I know. And so we eventually found our platform and got on the only train to Madrid that did not need a 14 euro per person seat reservation. Although it came at the cost of taking 4 hours and 39 minutes instead of 1 hour and 20 minutes since it was a slow train going through the beautiful Spanish countryside. Which was really pretty, so I'm not complaining. Oh well, this was a good start to Spain and we were really excited to visit Madrid. If you are as well, you should consider subscribing, because next week we'll see you there. Next up, Madrid. Thank God, water. We've been stuck in this desert for three long nights now. Finally, we can drink some water. You have water in your backpack.